Hey guys, what is up? My name is Severa, and today I am going to do my very first tutorial. So lately I've been getting quite a few messages of people really wanting to know how I do the, um, like how my FA profile has the huge name Severa right uh, at the top, and it's like all of text, there's not like a picture you could upload for it. Well, um, I'm getting so many questions of it, so I decided it would be a lot easier to make a video uh, explaining exactly how to do it. It's pretty simple, and really anyone should be able to make this work. Without further ado, let's get right into it. So if you want to do this, you have to go to a, uh, a website, it's like morph.us um, uh, slash pixelate, but I will give you the uh, link in the description, so if you need that, just go right down there. So if you want to get this to work, you're going to need an image, and it really doesn't matter what image you choose. Um, it really depends, like, the, the results of what comes out of it really depend on which one you choose, but it really depends on the size of it, I guess that's the main part. So I'm going to go to my commissions folder, I'm going to find um, an image. So this is the paw commission I got a while back, a paw icon. And um, so pretty much there's a little, to the left there's a little slider thing you have, and the, the uh, further back you go, the less blocks it is, um, but at the same time it's harder to see. Um, but if you go uh, maximum, this is the most detail it could be, and it's the larger amount of blocks it uses. Um, the downside is that using larger blocks, it, it can kind of take up a lot of space on the um, on your FA page, and there's only a limited amount of uh, characters you could use. So some of them may not be as good, but like for instance, the middle one it seems to be pretty pretty all right. The lower you go, the more pixelated and hard to read it becomes, and the higher you go, the uh, it's a lot more detailed. So a while ago, I had something very similar to this. I think I actually still have the I still have the file. Yes, yeah, this this leopard icon I have. I used to have something exactly like this on my page. I think it was more towards the middle though. And um and yeah, I used to have that. And that's just as good as like having like an icon or something. I actually have a, actually right now I have a logo that's just straight up like several logo. I don't don't really have much about it. Um I, I prefer it like this way. I prefer it this way because it's more simplistic and more kind of how I like it. I, I mean, I may maybe I'll add another picture there, but we'll have to see. Um, so, yeah, I just have like this little text thing, and uh, it's really easy to throw together. I just go to Photoshop, um, and like, I mean, if you, if you don't have a way to make one of these, just like straight up like simple um, font, like logo things, then just ask me. I'll, I'll make you one real quick. Um, so, yeah, like, so after you, let's find like, another random commission. Uh, let's see what else will look good. Um, whatever, we'll just go back to the pause. So, say I wanted to use this. Maybe I uh, like this exactly, maybe like how. Like the way this one looks, and the character amount is fine with me. You would copy this. Well, let me just do Control A. So you would copy all of this, and you would go. I'm not going to do. I already have it on mine. But you go to Profile Info, and what's actually loads. FA has been really slow today. And you go here, and you put it wherever you want. And there's so many characters that come that it comes with, so it can kind of be confusing at first. So just kind of play around with it, get it to work. Now, something that I like to do before I do any of this sort of stuff, um, I like to make a backup of all of my FA profile text because, uh, like, just simply saving this as a document on your computer and having a way to go back to it if you messed up is really useful. It takes like a second to do and it can save you a lot of time. Um, I never really have had any issues and had to go back to the backups, but think about it. If I work so hard on, on like something and like I, I save something I didn't mean to, or I make an edit, that, that, or I accidentally delete something, I always have that backup document, and I just like simply just like save it to a text document or something. I have it um, on Google Drive, so it's something simple like that. It can save you a lot of time, and maybe it maybe will come in handy, but it's definitely something you, could, you should just do, because why not? So anyways, if um, I really hope this helped you. If, if something didn't make sense to you, or you have a question, or need help with something, feel free to leave a comment. I will be more than happy to answer any questions you have. Um, and once again, with the whole uh, like icon thing, I'll be able to make you one of those. Also, feel free to share this video around with your friends. Um, I'm sure it'll be very helpful. And if you have any like issues at all, whatsoever, I'll be checking the comment section. Like, um, I get like notifications and stuff. So the second I get a question, I'll, I'll reply. Um, 
So yeah, guys, thank you very much for watching. Um, this is my very first tutorial, and hopefully over time I'll be adding more. If you have any ideas for future ones, you help something, I'll make a video about it. And uh, anyways guys, thanks for watching, I'll see you all later.